transposition cipher. A transposition cipher simply moves letters around rather than replacing them with something else. Transposition cipher encryption. Alice wants to send Bob a plain text message, meet me tomorrow. She simply reverses the letters in each word and is left with this cipher text. Transposition cipher decryption. Once Bob receives the message, Bob then decrypts the cipher text. This restores the message to plain text, meet me tomorrow. Rail fence cipher. Rail fence cipher involves writing a message in a diagonal format in a grid. Rail fence cipher encryption. Alice wants to send Bob a message. Textbook, page 3. Alice and Bob have agreed that the key is 3. This means the table will be in a format of three rows and the same number of columns as the letters in the message. Alice knows that the letters must be in the highlighted circles shown and the cells not used must be blanked out. Alice inserts the message in diagonal format, like this. By writing the letters from each row at a time, it produces a cipher text. Rail fence cipher decryption. Bob receives the message and knowing that the key is three, he is able to create a grid and decipher the message by inserting the text into the appropriate boxes. Bob is able to retrieve the plain text message by reading diagonally. The message is textbook, page 3. Root cipher. This is a method where the message is written in the form of a rectangle, choosing a root around a grid. Root cipher encryption. Alex wants to send Bob the message, meet me here tomorrow night. Alice and Bob agree the key start point to be the bottom left and cycle inwards clockwise. Using this rectangular table of four rows, insert the message down each column. As there is an empty box, X is used as a buffer to fill in spaces. Starting from bottom left, we cycle in woods clockwise. The cipher text is written down like this. Root cipher decryption. Bob has received a cipher text message from Alice. Bob knows that to decrypt this cipher text message, he must start bottom left and circle inwards. Since Bob knows the key, he can decrypt the message by adding the cipher text to the table like this. He can then read the message in the columns and decipher the plain text message, meet me here tomorrow night.